I tell you what's been on my mind? Sick and tired of the nine to five in the city light. Hey, darling, we could get out of town. See the beautiful world around, wanna see it now. And get in that car Leave a little note And we'll drive real far Let's get out We can leave this city Let's drive to the open air Yeah, the countryside is so pretty With the wind Okay, it's been so long Since I have filmed a YouTube video And I've been busy with this little one here Working I just finished a semester of school and everything, so. <laughs> so today I have a really fun thrift haul that I wanted to share. Um, I have things from clothing, especially for the summer, and then a couple home things, and even a couple little baby things. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get into it. So. First off, I'm just gonna start with some really fun, cute dresses that I've found at the thrift um, just over the last couple weeks. So the first one, I will start off with this, this blue one here. And it's actually from the um, Target brand Wild Fable. It's just a cute little blue um, tiered dress. You can wear it, I think, off the shoulder, but I kind of like it up like this so cute and fun for the summer um i love the print on it and i like that it's blue next up i have this really cute um wild fable again wild fable dress and i love the uh, color of it i love the little flower embroideries and again i think this is one of those again that you can wear like off the shoulder or up here like this that this would be so cute with some sandals. Um, I was really excited when I found this one on the rack. Okay, the next item I have here is another dress. This is a fun little gingham print dress. Again, off the shoulders or, no, I think this one is just meant to be off the shoulders. Um, but it's really cute, girly. It's a midi dress, so it's a little bit longer. I've already tried it on and I love it. I love the fit um, and just perfect for the summer, for a picnic or honestly just pictures, church. This one is kind of fun, a little bit more fancy. This is from Altered State. And I think these were really popular like a year or two ago, but I think this color is really nice and still would be really cute for like as a wedding guest dress it goes all the way down to the floor it's it has a slip but then um it like only goes to my knee and the rest of it is sheer so yeah really cute and only it was only a few dollars okay next up are just some random little things i found this handmade gingham top and it actually looks cute on so somebody hand me this because it has no tags and I can tell from the seams that it was sewn um, by someone so this is a really cute little simple fun top next up are just some t-shirts uh, white t-shirts I found this little life is good t-shirt um, this is honestly like what I would wear on a day-to-day -day basis T-shirts and shorts is kind of my thing for the summer. Oh no, I think I stained this shirt already. Oops. Yeah, I didn't, it, it didn't have that thing when I bought it. So that must have happened after I wore it or something. So this is just another little graphic tee that's cute. And I actually bought these pants the same time that I got that shirt. These are like little, um, I don't know, checkered print. It's like a pattern print dress pant and um i'm not gonna say vintage because 
I don't know how old it is, but it's like definitely older brand. There's pockets and I bought this um, shirt at the same time. I thought they'd be cute together, like kind of like a fun hipstery outfit with some black Tiva sandals. Um, yeah, so really cute and comfortable. You can dress these up or wear them casual. And then um, I found these green pants. They're from It's a New Day from Target as well. They're like, um, I don't think they're linen, but they're definitely, they definitely have that like linen material feel. And these are kind of pants that I love wearing this summer because they're lightweight and this green color was just really fun. And they hit me at about like the ankle or just a little bit below the ankle. So perfect for like pairing with sandals or tennis shoes, um, really fun color. And then I've been on the hunt for a black button up like this for a while because I saw, I saw like a really cute outfit with a black button up and some jean shorts, just really simple. Um, and I found this one, it's originally from Shein. It's a size large. Um, so it is like oversized on me, but I kind of like that fit. You can roll up the sleeves, you can tuck it in in the front. It has these really cute um, wooden buttons here. And it's, again, it's not linen, but it's kind of like that um, kind of copycat linen material. So it's really nice, um, really nice basic. And I can wear this all year round. And then up next, I have um, a couple different dresses here that are a little bit more form fitting. This is just like a black, this is super basic, like a black tight um, form fitting dress. But what I love about this is the length. It's a midi dress and I'm on the shorter side. So um, I don't know, I feel like midi dresses kind of elongate my body and this hits me like mid calf. So love the length of it and then when you sit down like you know you don't have to try to be pulling it down past your knees or something because it's a longer dress so i really love this you can like um put um like a button up opened over it or wear it with a jean jacket really cute this is another um form fitting or body con dress i i thought this pattern was cute and different something that I normally wouldn't go for. I do wish it was a little bit longer. This is going to hit me at, at about the knee length, but it's still a really cute pattern. And then this dress, this is different than all the other ones I've shown you guys, but I thought this would be cute for church, like, or even for like the fall time, maybe layered with like, um, a shirt underneath or like a turtleneck. So it's like a brown, um button-up dress and it's midi length as well so this is cute it's unbuttoned right now but you can kind of get the picture so really fun and cute more like on the i would say like dressier side i guess you could wear it with sneakers and like a white t-shirt too okay this is a really great find this is not from the thrift store this is from a flea market but my husband actually found it and got it for me. It was a little bit on the pricier side. It was $30, but it is a vintage Levi's jean jacket. Um, has an orange tab here and I don't know, the fit is just perfect for me. He originally wanted it for himself, but um, it was too small. And I don't know if it's a woman's, um, it's tagged as a large, but it just fits perfectly like oversized and comfortable on me so I love this I already cleaned out my closet of like three other jean jackets that this single one is replacing so I'm really happy about that let me move on to some home decor or like home item things that I have right here it's not too much actually let me start with the baby clothes so first off is this little romper and I think this is actually from a Target brand but you just buttoned up here really cute and if you guys have been thrifting before you know like uh baby or children's clothes is super cheap everything that i bought is like two dollars dollar fifty um 80 cents so whenever i see something cute i always 
grab it just because you can't beat the price and kids clothes like um at boutique shops and stuff like they can really tax on those so anyways I found this little cute dress look how cute this is so cute I love it I think this is homemade as well because there's no tag um but yeah I wish I could make something like this but I'm I'm happy that I found it at a thrift store next up is this little yellow cardigan that is so sweet and cute it's like I think it's 60% wool um and then uh, some other material but it's really thick and soft and it, it feels like really great quality so I love this little yellow sweater I wish I had it my size and then next up is this little purple romper I think this is like probably one of those Amazon um clothing brands but really cute still love the color and the little buttons and it was only like a dollar or two okay next up home things so first off I have this mirror here that it's so cute um love the size of it it has this wicker around it it's in really good condition it's not dirty or anything like that um, and the reason why I got it was because I thought it'd be really cute as like a little vanity mirror um, for my little girl either in her play area or you know when she gets her own room so love this little find here next up is a little toy and this is actually from um, a panda crate so I thought this was really cute just like a classic little wooden Montessori style toy Next up is this wicker or woven waist bin and I already we already are using this in her room but this was like four or five dollars and so that was really cute. I love the um the detailing here, the cutout. And then lastly I have this beautiful I wanna say handmade bowl and honestly I've been on the hunt for something like this. Um, and I still do want to find more, but I just love the look of this um, kind of pottery or ceramic bowl. And it has this really cute, nice grooving here. Um, and then it's kind of more of a shallower bowl. Shallower? More shallow bowl. <laughs> um, so definitely like if you are into bread making or um, maybe baking, but I thought it'd be cute like as a fruit bowl or just even like a decor piece on a kitchen shelf. Love this so much. It's already sitting on our um, kitchen windowsill and it looks beautiful. So, so that's it for my thrift haul today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I look forward to hopefully posting a little bit more on here, but I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye!